Welcome back to another ABC International video. Today we'll be discussing the top 5 business necessities. Before we start, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn your notifications on so you never miss a video. When starting a new business, you'll obviously be filled with excitement. A new venture and the opportunity to go out and create something you truly care about is something not a lot of people dare to do. However, at the same time, the comfort you felt when you compare yourself to where you are can now be comparable to the idea of being a big fish in a little pond. Now you've been picked up and dropped in the wide ocean where you're not so familiar with your surroundings. The first step to avoid this feeling and get out on the right foot is through clear planning and structure. Throughout your business journey, there'll be a lot of decisions you'll have to make where the outcome will seem uncertain. However, with proper planning, i.e. setting out a time scale and achievable goals and good business structure, these decisions are made far easier, making far likelier to head down the right path. Step two is SEO. SEO or search engine optimization is what makes your company visible to potential clients when they go on search engines. The better the SEO, the higher you rank on Google. It's essential for your website's SEO to be good so that you can reap the benefits it has to offer. For example, you'll be able to build brand awareness, engage specific audiences who will want your product or service, and you can show yourself off as an expert in your field. You want to think of your clients as detectives. You want to make their job as easy as possible when looking for your business. SEO makes you stand out from the crowd and gets the clients to you. So you want to tick off every single one of these and you'll be on the right way. Almost everyone has social media now. It's become a necessity in our lives to see what's happening in the world and how we receive our information so quickly. But did you know apps such as Twitter, Instagram and Facebook are extremely useful business tools? In fact, 91% of businesses use it as their primary form of marketing. You can show exactly what you can do for your clients and also add some personality to your company that normally wouldn't be shown through a website. It's an excellent way for you to get your business to take off quickly. As we've covered in earlier in the video, starting a company can be a daunting thing. But just because it can be uncertain doesn't mean you should play it safe. Taking risks can often lead to the biggest payoff. Take skydiving as an example. The fear of the jump doesn't outweigh the reward of the view. Taking risks has been known to increase confidence, allow you to learn new skills, and without it you'll never know how far your business can go. So take the jump and enjoy the view. Our fifth and final step is having effective copywriting. Copywriting is all the text you have on your website or social media posts. When you go to a website, you're likely to be put off it if you're bombarded with text so you don't even know what you're buying. Having quick, clear and succinct copywriting allows you to get straight to the point without confusing your clients. You don't want them to feel as if they're drowning in text like our man on the screen here. So keep it short and sweet and get to the point as quickly as possible. If you've managed to achieve all those business necessities, you'll have put yourself ahead of the competition and made yourself far more likely for those clients to choose you. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, check out the rest of the Alpha International YouTube channel for more content like this.